good morning children today we are going to read about a lazy person rip van winkle many years ago at the foot hills of the catskill mountain was a little village foot hills is the place of base of a mountain so at the base of the mountain there was a village its name was cart's skill in the village lived a simple good natured fellow named rip van winkle fellow here means man so there was a man whose name was rip van winkle he was a good natured person and he was very simple he was living in cart skill he was a kind neighbor ready to help anyone everyone in the village like him the children of the village started with joy whenever they saw him because he played with them he taught them to fly kites and shoot marbles and told them long stories the children of the village always liked rip and winkle because he used to play with them and taught them how to fly kite and shoot marbles he also used to tell them long stories which children enjoyed a lot the only problem with rip was that he was very lazy rip was very lazy person as fred as fred the frog was very lazy like that rip and winkle was very lazy he did no work on his own farm and just idled away his time it means that he was wasting his time and he was doing nothing on his farm farm may here means field where the crops are grown his fences were falling to pieces it means that fences is a boundary which separates the farms was falling and it was being torn his cow was going astray it means no one was there to look after the cows weeds grew on his farm weeds are the small grasses and wanted grasses in the farm so a lot of weeds grew on his farm rips constant campaigner was his dog it means rip has a good friend and he was a dog named ulf to avoid work he would walk away into the forest with his dog when he didn't want to work he would like to walk away with his constant companion ulf the dog one day rip just walk on and on and reached the highest part of the mountains it was late in the afternoon when he reached there what happened one day rip just walked with his dog and reached the highest part of the mountain and when he reached there it was afternoon he was very tired tired after his long climb he lay down and began daydreaming he was very tired so he lay down and began to daydreaming he began to dream in the day it was soon evening and he realized it would be night by the time he reached the village so rip van winkle realized that it is late in the afternoon it is getting night and if he will go into the village it will be very late in the night suddenly he heard a voice calling out rip van winkle rip van winkle he looked around and saw a short old man with thick hair and grizzled beard walking towards him with a barrel barrel is a container so when rip van winkle got up he heard his name he saw a short old man he has thick hair and great type beard and he has a container he made signs to help him carry the barrel repair it to help the stranger who caught his hand tightly so rip 
began to help that old person together they reached a place where there were some more old looking men playing nine pins nine pins is a game in which nine um, toys are there and they are being shot by a big ball and you have to make them fall down at a time they were all dressed the same way and all of them had beards of various shapes and colors they were very strange because they were all had beards of different shapes and colors their beard were even colors even though they were playing a game their faces were serious and there was silence although those li- little persons were playing games but they were serious and there was a pin drop silence the only sound was the noise of walls which echoed in the mountains like thunder and only one sound was coming and that sound was of ball which was echo echo is a sound which comes after striking anything so the sound of the ball seems to be like a thunder as rip and his companion reached them they stopped playing and stared at rip with fixed gaze as soon as rip and his dog wolf reached there they were looking at them fixedly rip was really frightened rip got frightened his companion emptied the contents of the barrel into glasses and made rip drink it the companion of the old man make a drink for rip in a glass rip overed as he was trembling with fear rip was very much fearful he was trembling like a leaf so he drank that drink made for rip since he was thirsty he drank a few more glasses and slowly fell into a deep sleep as he was very tired and he was feeling very thirsty he drank all water and he fell asleep and he went into a deep sleep on waking up he found that he was at the place where he had first met the old man when he got up he found himself at a place where he had met the old man he rubbed his eyes it was bright sunny morning it was very good morning it the sun was bright surely i have not slept here all night thought rip rip thought that he had not slept all night there he looked around for wolf he was looking for wolf his dog but he was no bear but there was no wolf wolf is the name of dog rip whistled him rip whistled for wolf 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 he then shouted no dog was to be seen where has this dog gone he muttered so he said in a slow voice where this wolf has gone wolf is the dog of rip van winkle so he called for his dog but he could not find him he began to descend the mountain to go back to his village descent means come back to come down so he was coming down towards his village as he neared the village he met a number of people but he did not know any of them the villagers also stared at him equally surprised when he came to the village nobody can recognize him even the person of the village were very much surprised to see ribbon winkle who is he the villagers were talking 
about his white beard and his slight lined face means wrinkled face on hearing this rip stroked his chin and to his astonishment he found his beard uh, had grown a foot long and it was all white when he heard about white beard he touched his chin and he was very surprised to know that his beard was grown a foot long a foot long means foot is the measurement of length it is smaller than a meter so rip van winkle found that his beard has become white and very long an old woman walked up to him and looked at his face for a moment then she exclaimed it is rip van winkle welcome home again old neighbor where have you been these 20 long years then there came an old woman and she gazed the face of rip van winkle for a second and she explained that he is rip van winkle and then asked him where he was for these 20 years as rip van was missing for 20 years it means rip van winkle slept for 20 long years on the mountain after drinking the water so you have seen that a person who is very lazy is punished like this from this story we learn that we should not be lazy